Hey planner friends, it's Ashley. Um, we are going to be planning inside of my mini catch-all and I had an idea that I'm going to attempt to execute and we'll see how it turns out. So I got the new flower sticker book, the Flower Power, the mega one from the Happy Planner. And I really wanted to pair this up with some Christmas stickers. So I have been digging through these. Let me find this other one here. And I have chosen these floral stickers with some of the stickers from the llama section inside of the Christmas Joy sticker book. So it's where the llamas are. These are really pretty. Unfortunately, there's not a ton of them that have these kind of colors inside of the um, Christmas Joy sticker book that I could use, but that's okay. We're going to try this anyways and see how it works. So, let's pull my pages out of my planner. And let's give this a whirl. All right, let's see here. So, the planner that I'm using for my catch-all is a mini dashboard planner from the Happy Planner. I love the dashboard planner. It is my favorite layout. It's very functional, but you can also decorate it. So I pulled this washi, little washi strips from here in the Flower Power sticker book. And let's go to town here and see what happens. Also, I am sitting down for this. Normally I stand up when I plan. And my chair is kind of squeaky, so y'all might hear my chair squeaking, but that's okay. For some reason, this feels like a sit-down sesh. And I really wanted to use this big giant sticker over here. Let me grab some white out and cover up where it says important. Elizabeth, if you're watching this, I cannot wait to see what you come up with. And if y'all are like, Ashley, what are you talking about? I was talking to um, Miss Elizabeth from E Joyful Plans, and I was telling her about my idea of wanting to pair the florals with Christmas and she was excited about it too and said she's gonna try it so I'm telling her if she's watching this I cannot wait to see what she does and if you pair the florals with Christmas please tag me in it if you post it on Instagram because I would love to see it and that is so pretty on its own oh my goodness okay I love that very very much and I think I want to put this little box sticker over here so we're gonna try that Actually, let's take it all the way down. Um, also, if the camera is shaking, it's because I'm bouncing my head off the light. I use a ring light to film and I keep bouncing my head off of it and it shakes the whole thing. So that's there too. And I think this little llama guy, llama and Santa. Oh, see, he's huge. Hold on. There's a llama sticker in here that's just the llama. Let's see if it'll fit. Oh, he's cute. All right, I love that, that looks good. And then I'm gonna take this one here says errands. I'm gonna put it up here. And then this one says to-do list and we're gonna put it over here. And then I have this box sticker that has Santa on it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I thought about maybe cutting it down some and sticking it here. So let's try that. There's actually two of these stickers inside of the Christmas Joy Book. So if I mess this one up, we have a backup.
Ooh, we got a little close to Santa's beard there. A little close. See, now we're gonna need some more color back there. Hold on, let's see. There's some really cute washi inside of here, like some washi strips, but it was all super bright. And really thick. Let's actually see what this would look like. Okay, let's try this one. So we'll take this one up. see what Santa looks like. I'm trying to kind of center it here. Whoa, that didn't work, did it? Yeah, I didn't really get that very centered, did I? <laughs> oh, that's okay. I think that looks cute. You can still see that. I usually try to cover up where it says like Monday through Sunday over here, but I don't worry about it if I don't get it covered up, but that's really cute. I like it. And then I found a couple of box stickers in the floral sticker book. Monday we have Cub Scouts and I have a team call. So I'm gonna stick this one here for my team call. And then we'll put this one here for Cub Scouts. And then if I need a to-do list for Monday, I'll just write it in over there. I have this, these really cute birds that I kind of wanted to use. But I don't know where to use them. We're gonna put him right there. That looks cute. And then let's see, let's find a couple more of the floral stickers. And I'm thinking this one, nope, not that one, hold on. Okay, so I really wanted to use a Santa with a llama. I thought that would be really, really cute. Oh, crud. Oh, nope, I was not ready for that. You guys ever notice the clear stickers? They are like staticky to the paper. <laughs> they just wanna stick themselves wherever. That's a little big. But let's go for it. You're gonna lose Santa's arm here. I'm so sorry, Santa. He's definitely gonna put me on the naughty list for that one. Cutting off his arm. Whoops. I do not like that at all. I'm gonna to have to get some smaller floral stickers out for the, over on this page.
And then I think I want to put a little bit of the red here. And then a little strip over here. And then I have a couple of these like little circle stickers that I thought were really cute. And this one says season greetings and it has a little postcard on it or a envelope I mean. And um, I should be getting our Christmas cards in the mail soon and I want to get those sent out. I really don't know what day so we're going to go towards the weekend. We'll go like with Thursday not the actual weekend but we'll go with Thursday. They should be here by then, and then I can get our Christmas cards sent out. I really need a bird on this side, don't I? Maybe I don't. Let's get... Another floral sticker for there. that okay do I add more or do I stop this is the point where I have to I have to think about that because I have a few other stickers not very many um, but I have a few other stickers one of them I really wanted to use for wrapping presents and then I also wanted some more box stickers in there so let's see what other box ones we have Let's go with this one here. And then I can just write like wrap presents in it. That looks cute. Okay, I think I'm gonna be done. I think I'm gonna leave it where it is and I think it turned out really, really cute. Let me see something really quickly. Is there more? See, I don't have any more of the red polka dot washi. I wish I did. I would love to have a little strip of it up here. Darn. Okay. So I'm going to be done, I think, and I'm going to leave it where it is, and I think it turned out really cute, and I'm really glad that I had the idea and I tried it, because this is a really cute spread. All right, you've got to let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. Do you like this spread? Do you think that pairing Christmas and florals um, you know, not your typical Christmas florals, but Christmas and florals together is a good idea. Are you like, huh, I don't really know, not my style. It's totally okay if it's not your style. You can let me know that, no big deal. But just let me know what you think about it down in the comment section. And also, if you haven't, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. And thank you so, so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Santa's gonna come and join us in this song hey.